You're like, I'm an adult. Sorry, I'm the one who operated a successful YouTube channel. Me. For me. I'm the one who puts out the content that's entertaining. Hello, and welcome to James, the Lesser Express Line, where we get you in and out as fast as possible with... Thanks to Josh Poem for these clips. We're in DSP. He makes meaningful content. And it would be meaningful to see this part of the game, so you go watch someone else. Wait, what? But you're playing the game. You're the one playing the game. People watching you playing the game, and you're telling your audience to have them go watch someone else if they want to see this meaningful content. All right, well, let's just watch the clip. If I met someone like Haruka at the end, would I really skip that? I mean, obviously, that's that's meaningful to everyone who's played Yakuza over the years. But at the same time, is it essential? No, I don't think so. I feel like, you know, if you wanted to, you could look that up and watch it yourself. Or, you know, like, I feel like that story's ended already, right? Like, it's nice to get this final goodbye to Haruka, maybe. But I feel like it already is over. Good hearty snort. We've already moved on from that plot line. You know what I'm saying? You may have moved on. But yeah, people have been playing these games for you no know, 9, 10, 11 games with spinoffs and shit. But, uh, and it would be meaningful, but uh, don't watch me. Watch someone else. Dark Gaming says, I guess I'm a different gamer. I want to see the conclusion to a character I played for nine games. I do too. I do too. But I, fucking do I it. didn't make all these games at once. And also, you know, I, I do this for a business and I can't kill the business to see a few cutscenes. <laughs> I'm just being honest. If you chose like a dragon. You dropped Final Fantasy VII Remake, Rebirth, whatever. When that was making you more money. Mind you, again, like a dragon has gone on to make $5 in a single stream before. But he kept playing it. He kept playing like a dragon when it's making him $5 a stream. But now he can't play it because it's going to kill the business. Then why are you still playing it instead of Final Fantasy VII, which was making you more money? If I want to see them, I can look them up. You know what I mean? Like, it's not like 100 people didn't already beat this and put full playthroughs online already that if I there's some meaningful cutscene I need to see that I can just go see it. It's an optional cutscene for a reason, you know? Again, DSP, telling your audience to stop watching you and watch someone else, probably not a good business thing to do. Just saying. And I don't even have a business degree. I mean, you want, to be, you want me to be truthful? If Haruka is in this game, she should have been in the main story. She should have absolutely been part of the main story of the game because it would have been meaningful. Not a hidden side quest down a, a, a corridor of 20 required side quests to get to her. Uh, that's stupid. Yeah, it should have been part of the main story. <clears throat> One of the aspects of the Yakuza games is all the side content. One of the aspects of the entire series is, yeah, here's the main story, but all the side content is where we hook you. All the side content is what people talk about. And the people play these games for the side content a lot of the times. Because the side content is so fucking good. Like, the developers made sure that the side content was fucking awesome. But guys, I don't want to play the parts that's actually good of the game. I just want to play the main story that people don't care about. Once again, business degree. Dumbass. Not that I'm let you go. Thank you for watching. As always, like, subscribe. Comment down below and have one hell of a day.